everyone. My name is Daisy Daniel. I am a life coach with My Moment Life Coaching Services. And I am going on a personal journey to let my hair grow gray. I already did one video which I uploaded last month. Today is the second month anniversary of when I stopped dyeing my hair. Yes, on the 17th of every month is another month. And I want to show you what my hair is looking like. I'm going to show you in a little bit. It's not too dramatic yet. But I came up with five reasons as to why I wanted to let my hair grow gray and I decided I wanted to share it with all of you. So this is going to definitely be fun for me anyway. I don't know how much entertainment you'll get out of it, but I'm sure having a good time. Did you all know that gray right now is a very popular color? I was just told that by a few people. I had no idea because I don't really follow trends, I don't have time for that, but apparently gray right now is a very popular color. And so I am doing something that's actually trendy. Go figure. All right. <laughs> what I wanted to do is every month talk about one of my reasons. So I have five reasons. We're going to start with my first reason today. But before I do that, I want to give a shout out to my mom. My mom, three years ago when I opened up my coaching practice, got me some lights and she said, these are for the YouTube videos that you want to do for life coaching. Because I had talked about it. She bought me these lights on my birthday years ago and I am now starting to use them. So thank you, mom. Moms are awesome, aren't they? And then also a shout out to my brother who is such a cool brother. He supports me in so many different ways. He's awesome. I have two wonderful brothers, uh, but Tony put up this dry erase board for me, so thank you, bro. Love you. <laughs> I definitely want to give a shout out to them. Also, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe. If you want to follow the journey with me and do this along with me, yay, we will support each other along the way. If you just want to observe and just see how someone does this, maybe learn some tools here and there, Subscribe also. Give me a like so I know that you are liking these kind of videos for me to keep doing it. Actually, I'm going to keep doing it whether you like it or not. So there. I'm planning on doing this for the next year and a half because apparently that's how long it takes to grow your hair out from here to here. Oh yeah. But I'm going to have some nice silver healthy hair I think at the end of this process. So if anything, you will get a few good laughs, hopefully some good tools to come out of all of this. Now, in January, I turned 50, and my dream was to go to New York City. I wanted to go, walk around New York City for a few days and celebrate my birthday. Did that happen? No. But that's okay. It will happen one day. I will go to New York City. It just didn't happen on my 50th birthday. So this summer, I was thinking, wow, um, I had a nice birthday, I celebrated and everything, but I wanted to do something spectacular for myself, not for anybody, for me. And I started thinking and I thought, you know, I think I'm going to let my hair grow gray for my 50th. So that's what started this whole idea and then I started just thinking about why I would want to do it, came up with some reasons why I would want to do it, and that's why we're here, folks. So. <laughs> My first reason, let's get right into it. Physical transformation at age 50. So 50 is a benchmark, you know? That is like, hurrah, you're 50, this is amazing. And I feel good at 50, I, I'm happy at 50. A lot of things have gone well for me, okay? But every so often, I like to have a little transformation just in my style, the way I look, the way I do my hair, just everything. And I tend to have the same style for quite a while. And then, for, I mean, I'm talking about years, like maybe 10, 12 years, I have the same style. And then all of a sudden I change my style. I would say the style I have now, which is curly hair, and then sometimes I straighten it. And then this color that you see, my hair is actually a little darker than this. I've had this style now for like seven years. So I'm ready to have a different style. Not only do I want to let my hair grow gray to look different, I also want to lose some weight. 
So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to include those videos in this. I'm not going to include that journey on this, these videos. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do separate videos for that. And I actually started back on the 4th intermittent fasting this, this month, July 4th. I started that. I'm not going to get into it now, but look for videos on the 4th of every month because I will upload very similar format to this. The reasons why I'm doing it and what I'm learning and, and just the whole journey of this. If you want to join me on that, by all means, please do. My channel on YouTube is My Moment Life Coaching Services. I hope you come visit my website. I have some articles on there and just other things that I do. Eventually these videos will make it to my website. But until then, they're going to stay on YouTube. All right. Physical transformation. So yeah, that's what I want to do. And I want you guys to follow me on this journey. Not because I don't like the way I look. I'm happy the way God made me and, and how I look and everything. But I want to have a totally different look that doesn't cost me a lot of money. Something that would be work for me to achieve because I like a challenge. I, I'm a very hard working person. So I like to have goals and set, I'm constantly setting goals for myself and doing different things like that. So that is the reason why I'm doing that. Okay, my highs. Um, I'm gonna talk every month about my highs and lows, any epiphany I might have had that month and some kind of inspirational thyroid quote. So my highs is this. I have been reading that when you have a new experience, it could really change your life. It could improve your, your confidence and actually give you like a paradigm shift in your life. That's my high right now. That's what I'm hoping comes from all of this. Not that I'm able to help myself, but I'm also to help others. Okay, so I am going to be sharing different tools throughout these videos and you could use those tools and transfer that to anything it is you want to change. It doesn't have to be dyeing your hair gray. I am sure that you will learn some tools here that will help you with different things that you're working on. All right, my lows. I didn't really have too many lows this month, only a couple. I had one girlfriend when I told her what I was doing, really, really, really tried to talk me out of it. She said, you're going to look so old. You are, please don't do it. She was almost on her knees begging me to not do this. I started laughing because I, I just thought it was so funny. And I, I said, um, excuse me, whose hair is this? Is it your hair or my hair? And of course she said, it's my hair. Yeah, it is my hair. So if I want to let it grow gray, <laughs> Man, that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> and then I had a very close relative tell me, I don't really think you're going to do it. I know you. I know you very well. And you're not going to be able to do that. Ah, oh, just what I needed. A challenge. Yes. So now, you know, I got to prove this relative wrong, right? Of course. Now, am I going to like it all great? I hope I do. But you better believe that if I don't, that I will go back and be the first one dyeing my hair. That is yet to be discovered, folks. I am going to go through this whole journey and then see it full length gray for, you know, a good month before I make my decision. But it is not a moral choice. It's just a lifestyle choice and the way it makes you feel. If having gray hair makes you feel old, and that's what you believe, then that's what you're going to believe. If gray hair makes you feel confident and trendy and all those wonderful things, then that's what you're going to believe and that's how you're going to feel. So right now I feel pretty good. I had some, lots of, lots of highs. My epiphany, I did have an epiphany the other day. I was at Costco and... This has never happened to me. I was pushing my cart and then I noticed myself looking at people's hair and seeing if they had gray. I've never in my life have stopped to analyze people's hair to see if they had gray in their hair. But I was like, oh yeah, she's got a lot of gray. Ooh, wow, he's full of gray. Oh yeah, wow, look at all that gray. And so 
what, what it made me think about is when we have a new experience, then it opens us up to other experiences that we've never had and other ways of thinking that we never stop to think about. It's really fun. You should try it if you want. <laughs> Only if you want, folks. Anyway, a inspirational thought or a quote. I'm going to go with my all-time favorite quote, and that is a quote by Bill Gates. And he says, everybody needs a coach. And I totally believe that. I have had coaches. I will continue to have coaches. I am a coach. And in life, we need support. So these videos could be a support for you. And that's what I hope they are. They definitely are a support for me. It's going to be a form of accountability for me to really stick to my word and do what I say I'm going to do. Why? Because I already told a bunch of people what I'm doing. And now I'm going to be held accountable. And that is always effective when you want to change something. Whatever it is, whether it's quitting alcohol, quitting drugs, quitting some form of addiction. If you vocalize what it is you're doing, all of a sudden you have a cloud of witnesses that are like, Oh yeah? Remember what you said you were going to do? <laughs> I might have been at the beach today had I not had this commitment, but look, I'm here keeping my word. So anyway, thank you for joining me. I say we could go ahead and check this box because I gave you the reason why I wanted a physical transformation at age 50. Now, I won't be totally transformed by the time I turn 51, because like I said, this process is going to take a good year and a half, but I could say that on my 50th, I started this fun journey for myself. So I will be able to see that, say that, and then my hair by January, my guess is that it'll be like gray down to here. So that's going to be a sight to see. You're not going to want to miss that. All right, guys, thank you for joining me. Please tell your friends about this. Anyone you think could get encouraged from these kind of videos, please forward it to them. Give them my link, and I will share the links on the bottom of this video. Hit subscribe, like, and the bell notification button so that you're sure to receive the one I'm going to do on the 4th of August, okay? And that's going to detail what I'm doing to try to get in shape and eat healthier and all of that. So I love you guys. Have a great week and I will see you next month. Bye!